forgot to film an intro for my camping video. I just went right into the camping video. So I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me this weekend on my camping trip. I cannot wait to share all of our fun adventures with you. We're actually heading up to Priest Lake, Idaho, which is gorgeous, like absolutely positively a gorgeous, gorgeous place. So I'm gonna take you guys with me. You're gonna see what I eat, even a little bit of what I eat on my splurge day, and just get to take in the gorgeous scenery along with us. So if you wanna see all about what I ate for camping, how I stayed on track, what I ate when I wasn't on track, and just a little bit of fun with my family, all you have to do is stay tuned. So we're packing up our food to go camping, so I'll show you a little bit of what we're bringing with us. So we're bringing some snacks, some tortilla chips, some cheese it snapped, of course, s'more stuff, so marshmallows, chocolate, graham crackers, bringing some snacks for me to stay on track today and Saturday. So I have some smart sweets. These new peach rings, you guys, are so good. My code is Jen Clayton for free shipping. There is a link down in the description box. So definitely love me the peach rings and the gummy bears. I'm bringing some of my prots from my Protein Wise haul. Again, there's a link for that down in the description box as well that will get you $10 off your first order. I got these snacks at my WW workshop. I had never ate them, so I'm gonna bring those and the roasted chickpeas. Duh, of course I'm bringing a Bilt Bar. I already had one today, so this is for Saturday on my way home. This is the cinnamon chocolate cream. Again, down in the description box, 10% off free shipping with the code Jen's WW Journey 2019. So that's a staple to bring. My coffee that I picked up, uh, just because I have to make coffee in a regular coffee pot, God forbid, while we're camping. Some syrup, because we're gonna have blueberry pancakes for breakfast on Friday. Picked up some fun brown butter toffee cookies. Grits, we need these for our crackers, meat and cheese. Grilled beans, we're gonna do this with some burgers on Friday. Of course, condiments, so light mayo, regular ketchup, no sugar added ketchup. We're gonna do hash browns on Saturday morning for breakfast. Picked up some French onion dip, that's to dip the chips in. Of course, butter, we need that for cooking in general. Here is the salami that I picked up for cheese and crackers. Sausage for Friday morning. Remember, Friday, I'm not tracking. It's my weekly day, so that's why we are having the higher calorie things on Friday. Of course, eggs. Grab some cheese for our burgers, and then I'm gonna chop this cheese up. It's delicious. This is for the cheese and crackers. Saturday, we're gonna have a healthy bacon, so we'll do this uncured turkey bacon. Tonight we're gonna do hot dogs, so regular hot dogs and my fat-free Hebrew National. Big burger patties for Friday night dinner. Little Smokies, we love cooking these on the fire, so fun. I'm also bringing my leftover salsa to have with the tortilla chips. I like bread and butter chips on my burger, so I grabbed those. And then just some cooking spray, salt and pepper. So look at all that, holy mole. And then over here, blueberries and strawberries and hot dog and hamburger buns. So that is a lot of food. I'm gonna get it packed up and then we'll be ready to pack up the car, get my clothes packed and we'll be ready to pack up the car. And somebody is very excited to go camping. Are you excited, buddy? Yeah, you're so excited. So we rented a truck for our camping trip because we no longer have one. We actually have my car, which is an SUV, and then my husband has a Jeep Wrangler. So we decided to rent a truck thinking that it would be large enough to not only haul the four-wheeler, which as you can see, we have the four-wheeler, but large enough for our entire family, two dogs and two people. But look at this, we literally look like the Clampets. So we've got our four-wheeler back there. We've kind of shoved things in every nook and cranny. We have wood totes and then we even left the back seat open as much as we could for diesel so we put sheets down because if you have a lab you understand that they shed a lot so there's chairs under here we actually had to throw our cooler in our bag for our clothes so yeah it's going to be a full ride but we are super excited all we have left to do is basically strap everything down and then we are on our way hi handsome diesel Diesel, hey, you ready to go camping? You got your own back seat, buddy, Lola. Lola, hey, hi. Are you ready to go camping? Lola, look at mama. Oh, she's looking at her dad. Lola, you ready to go camping? 
All right, guys, we're gonna hit the road. We are about to hit the road. We need to stop on our way out somewhere, grab some ice at a gas station, but the whole family, Malola, is about to hit the road to head camping. So, oh, oh, hi, Rachel, I know. So I'll take you guys along with me on this entire trip. We're gonna ride our four-wheeler, we're gonna have ice cream, go on a walk, super excited. Someone's lips are flapping in the wind and he's happy as happy can be. So here's the cabin that we're staying in. It is so cute. It's called the Grizzly. It is super, super cute. I'll take you guys inside and show you, but we are just getting unpacked. We just got here. So I'll take you guys in and show you, but it's super cute. It has power um, and heat, but it does not have a bathroom or really a kitchen. So it's pretty basic, but it's super cute. So. There is this whole area over here, sort of as a kitchen. So there's some shelving. It's kind of dark, sorry. There's a cute little bench there that you guys can sit at, you know, if you wanted to sit in here. There is a nice little nightstand. We brought some blankets of our own, but there's actually a log bed. That's where Troy and I will sleep. And then this is super cool. If you have kids, there is a whole entire double bunk area with those cute little benches. And there's a whole set of bunks over here as well. And this is cool because it has a door so you can keep yourself private if you wanted to keep your kids separated. So super cute in here. It's just gorgeous. Look at that. Absolutely, positively gorgeous. We are so excited to sleep on a bed and not have to be in a tent. Diesel is in heaven. All right, guys, get it. Oh, go buddy, go. He's so happy and the water is pretty cold, but he doesn't mind at all. She's pretty not interested in going in the water, but dad's throwing sticks. <laughs> Here's the lake. It's super pretty. Really, really pretty here. It's super windy, but are you happy on the beach? Yeah, Lily, well, you wanna go in the water? You want to? Come here. You can go in the water. Come on. Come on. your private bed buddy he's pooped he just had that really fun time swimming down at the lake and someone else copied her brother and came in and laid on the other bunk bed I have everything all nice and organized so I have all of my dry food and then Lola's little sweater which I love camera sticks to roast marshmallows we've got our nice little area set up here so this is like our kitchen area We've got our cups, plates, silverware. I've got some nice bowls with lids. And then, uh, of course, coffee. So, there's no plug-in in here, but there is in the vehicle. So, I'm going to be brewing some coffee in my car tomorrow. Dog treats. And then we have a little shelf here that has all of our cleaning supplies on. So, this cabin is awesome. Our food cooler is down there. And then out here, we just have put our drink cooler. And then our camp stove. And then Troy stacked all the wood and put our chairs out here in case it rains. Hey guys, we just got settled into our camper, so I'm gonna have a little bit of a snack. I'm actually like friggin' starving. I've hardly eaten anything today. So I went ahead and I cut up some strawberries and there's some blueberries in there. So I'm gonna have that. And then I'm also going to have the WW Chili Lime Quinoa Strips. They're okay. They're a little bit spicy. And as you know, I'm not a huge spice person. And then, of course, I have my cute little pink camo koozie and my orange vanilla Coke. So, so far today, I 
ate my breakfast meal prep for four. My coffee was one, so that's five. I had a built bar for three, so that's eight. And then for lunch, I literally had a quest bar, so that puts me at 12. And then I had a sweet nothings that puts me at 13. And that's all that I've had today. So my quinoa strips will put me at 15. Um, so I'm only at 15 out of 33 points. And for dinner, we're gonna cook some hot dogs on the barbecue. So I'll be able to have hot dog with a bun. And then I have some chips and I don't know what else, we will see. And then I'm trying to save a little bit of room in my budget of points so that I can have at least a marshmallow tonight and save my s'more for tomorrow. So everything's going good. It's a, it's a decent day. It's not hot. It's about 60 degrees which is actually perfect and we just came back from the lake as you saw so we're going to get everything settled unload the fourth four-wheeler and then we will grill up some hot dogs for dinner and just chill by the fire cannot wait maybe go on a four-wheeler ride of course i'll take you with me if i do so so far we are having a fabulous time all right guys i'm on the four-wheeler i'm gonna take you guys on just a little ride around the park show you kind of what the camping area looks like that we're staying in and then we may go on some trails if we can find some. But I'm going to flip you around and show you Priest Lake State Park. of the state park are these little dirt roads so once you exit the state park you're free to ride your four-wheeler around at a higher speed than within the state park so I'm gonna go on just a little ride down the road see if I can spot any wildlife just enjoy a little bit of on my four-wheeler here before I head back to camp for some dinner <music> while since I've been able to go out on a little four-wheeler ride even though we can ride in our neighborhood super fun so I'm heading back to camp so that my husband can go on a quick ride and then we are gonna have some hot dogs so I'll show you what I'm having for dinner hey guys I'm back at the cabin let me just tell you we are loving having this cabin it is so nice it is so much better than a camper we had a camper that we sold last year and i will never go back to a camper this is so much better so troy is on his ride i'll try to get some footage of him when he comes back so i just got done brushing diesel my goodness that dog sheds lilith's here on my lap and there's diesel He's watching for Troy to come back. So that's generally what happens when his dad is gone. He sits there and watches for him. So I'll try to grab some footage of Troy when he comes back, but the cabin life is the way to go. There's dad, bud. There he is. He's coming. Troy's coming back. Diesel sees him. Let's see if I can zoom in on him. Oh, yeah. There he comes, buddy. So here is my dinner for tonight. I have some more blueberries. So I this will be my second fruit for today. And then I've got some of the Mission Tortilla Strips. These are them. These are actually really, really good. I love them even by themselves. So I have a serving of those for four points. And then I have a one hot dog bun for three points and one hot dog for one. So that's four for the hot dog, three for or four for the chips, eight points. So that puts me at 20 three points i'm going to have another hot dog and some marshmallows so this is going to be a perfect dinner and then i also have a bottle of diet tea so this is my camping dinner night one so look at mom hi baby lola lola are you done camping she doesn't really like it lola whoa diesel hi buddy did you hear that crow the wings I know. Hi guys, are you guys having fun? Say we went on a walk to the store. Yeah, we did all that already today. Troy's out riding the four-wheeler, so we decided to come in the cabin. Hi buddy, you shake, shake mama, diesel. 
Oh, good boy, but are you having fun? Yes. And she's been ready to go home for quite a while, so we wrapped her up, and they've been taking a little nap, and then we'll take him down to the lake, and we're having a really good day so far. Hey, guys. It is about 11 o'clock. We've already walked. The dogs have walked twice. We went to the store to get some dish soap to clean the pan that our nice neighbor let us borrow. And I've ridden down to the lake and checked my phone. We don't have any service unless we are actually down at the lake. So that's why you won't hear from me much or anything. So I just try to film when I can, but it's been really fun. We're gonna take Diesel to go swimming. We're gonna play some Uno. It's kind of our jam when we camp, but day two so far has been a lot of fun. The sun is out, so we're just gonna enjoy our day. I'll be back to show you guys what I'm having for lunch. Sorry the clip of breakfast was a little short. My memory card filled up, so I moved on to the next memory card. But yeah, so far camping day two's been awesome. Good boy, bud. Good boy, yeah, that's a good dog, buddy. Oh yeah, yeah. Hi, Lola Luz. Hi. Oh, Bubba. Look at all that, buddy. Good boy. Oh, you're being a good, oh yeah, I know. Hi, handsome. Oh yeah, show dad, show dad you're soaking wet. <laughs> so cute. That's a big stick, buddy. Oh yeah, tell daddy, say throw my stick. Oh, good boy. Bring it in. Bring in your, oh, Baba, that's huge. Oh, good boy, buddy. Yeah, you take an Eddie stick. Oh, yeah. Good boy, bud. <laughs> For lunch today, we've got some Ritz. I cut up some extra sharp white cheddar cheese. I bought these little salami rounds, so it makes it really easy to do cheese and crackers. And then we have some fresh blueberries. And then I'm finishing up my second little pot of coffee. So this is going to be lunch. So it went from sunny to hail. Welcome to Washington or Idaho, wherever we are. Hell. Hell. <laughs> Look at me with your hood. Yeah. <laughs> We went from sunny to this, guys, sunny to this. And the sun is back in a matter of 15 minutes. Not that we're complaining, we're happy that the sun is back. Currently happening, we're playing Uno and she's snoring. Say hi, buddy, say hi. We just got done roasting some marshmallows, had some s'mores. The dogs are so ready to go in, so we're gonna go ahead and head in to the cabin, maybe play some more cards, but it was a super fun day. Did you crawl right into bed the minute you got in the cabin? You sure did. She's exhausted. He's in here, you he can't see him very well, but he crawled right into his bed too the minute we got in the cabin, so. We are in for the night. This cabin is awesome. Another fun day in the books. It's about nine o'clock. We just came into the cabin. We're just gonna chill, relax, maybe play some cards and put my pajamas on. But yeah, it was a super fun day. The dogs are exhausted. I actually took about a half an hour nap, which was so nice, because as you know, we never get to do that at home because of work. So day two of camping was fantastic. So back on track tomorrow, I did end up having um, a whole sheet of graham cracker s'more, had a couple beers, so it was a really good day, but back on track tomorrow. So I'll show you what I'm having for breakfast, and I think we are gonna go ahead and head home as soon as we get up and get packed up so that we can do some laundry and spend a little bit of time at home before my husband goes back to work on Sunday. But day two was super fun. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning at about 7.30. It's been kind of drizzling, raining all night, so we decided to skip making breakfast this morning, and we're just gonna kind of pack up, get ready to head home. I need to upload my grocery haul. We have to take back our rental truck. So it's going to be a really busy day. So we decided to skip making breakfast, avoid the rain, dirtying up the neighbor's pan again. And Diesel's ready to go home. He is laying on the bed all cozy and Lola's over here buried in the blanket. So we're gonna let them rest while we finish packing up everything but the bedding. 
and we're gonna head home. You can see here that I'm starting to pack up this room. I have lots of cleaning to do, and I've been kind of packing up our food area as well. So getting ready to hit the road. Hi guys, we are home. I have showered. There's no makeup, but that's okay. We're home, home. I am doing laundry. I have laundry, loads and loads of laundry, but we had such a fantastic time. We would have stayed a little bit later today if it wasn't raining, but that's totally okay. We had such a great trip. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of the fun that we had. Diesel and Lola had such a good time. Well, especially Diesel. Lola is a California girl. She's kind of a princess. Not a big camper, but she's happy to be in the cabin. So we had so much fun. I hope you enjoyed a little bit of what I ate throughout the camping trip both on track and on my day that I use my weeklies. And again, thank you so much for coming along with us. You are all part of our family, so it's nice to take you with us on some of our family adventures. So if you're new, make sure you subscribe, hit that little bell so you're notified when I upload. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below. I wanna hear what you thought of our camping trip and just if you enjoy seeing this little bit of day in the life type of footage as well as WW content. So thank you again so much for watching. See you guys all in my next video. Bye guys.